To find the oxidation state for the lead in PBF2, lead 2 fluoride, we'll use these rules here. First off, there's no negative or positive sign after the PBF2. That's because it's a neutral compound. All the oxidation numbers, they're going to add up to zero. We won't find lead here on our list. Lead's a transition metal, and it has different oxidation states depending what it's bonded to. Here it's bonded to fluorine. and Fluorine's the most electronegative element on the periodic table. It has a minus one oxidation state. So each fluorine is minus one. If we multiply two times minus one, we'll get a minus two. So for all the oxidation numbers to add up to zero, we have to have a plus two on the lead here in PBF2. So we can check our work. Two times minus one, that's minus two. Minus two and plus two, that gives us zero since this is a neutral compound. This is Dr. B with the oxidation numbers for PBF2, lead 2 fluoride. Thanks for watching.